continuing on our exploration of triangles and the interior and exterior. Since we know what exterior angles are now, we do have this exterior angle theorem for triangles, which says if you have an exterior angle of a triangle, okay, then it is equal to the sum of the two opposite interior angles. So the, in other words, here's my triangle right here. I've got tri triangle A, B, C, and then I've got these interior angles, angle A, angle B, and then angle A, B. ACB, okay, got these three. So this exterior angle, what it's saying up here is that this exterior angle is equal to the sum of these two added together. And you can easily check that and verify that. That's what I got right here. If I take the measure of angle A, measure of angle B, because those are the angles that are opposite this guy, not adjacent with it, okay, the angles opposite this guy, right here. If I add those together, it should give me the measure of angle BCD right here. BCD, that's my exterior angle. Here are the angles opposite. So if I take 10 degrees and 100 degrees, that's 110 degrees, which is the same as that guy that's right there. And then right here, kind of review that triangle sum theorem that you saw on the previous page, that if I add all three of these angles inside, take this angle and this angle and this angle and add it together, it should be 180 degrees. So measure of angle A, measure of angle B, plus measure of angle ACB, Add those together, it's 180 degrees. So that's 10 degrees plus 100 degrees plus 70 degrees. That's 180 degrees, it checks out. So triangle sum theorem, add up all these guys inside, equals 180 degrees. Exterior angle theorem, add up the two angles that are opposite it, not adjacent, these are adjacent, at the angles that are opposite, should be that guy.